What's up, guys? It's DLB Gaming here, and today with a whole bag of merchandise that my friend brought me from Japan. Uh, let's just crack this open. It's, the bag is so big that I can't deal with my whole camera. So let's see. There's these. This is way bigger than I expected. I thought it would be a perfect feat for my uh, dice and uh, damage counter and stuff, but I can put like a whole deck in there with all my damage counter and stuff. It's an Espeon. I was looking for an Umbreon, but then she couldn't find it. There was only Espeon for it. So I guess this is a gift. They were having an event right now at the Pokemon Center. Like, once you reach like a certain amount of purchase, they'll give you souvenirs like these. This is a perfect fit for dice and damage counter. And it looks cool with a Pikachu with the Japanese traditional costumes and stuff. And I have to open this one. This should be a gift from purchasing stuff. And I believe it's a sticker. I think so. Yeah, you can tell from it. It's a huge one with the second generation Ho Oh, the trio Pokemon, and the starter. The second. Oh, I should put these away and leave my stuff on the bench. Yeah, they're too big that they won't even fit into the whole screen. There's our first small bag inside the big bag. We have... <laughs> yeah, a Gloom plushie or a keychain, but with Ditto face. They're having this Ditto uh, product line with all different Pokemons in their shape but with a Ditto face. There was also Coughing and Magnemite when I was going through the online website. Let's see what we got here. Oh yeah. This was the promo card that they were giving out when you uh, check out with your items. And it's a Beware. I think it has the same move as the one that they released in uh, Guardian Risings. But there is this yeah, Pokemon Center logo on the right bottom of the picture and here is this I guess it's just an advertisement or well, you can also like color it but we're too old to do that right I'll leave that aside and here's my first pack of deck sleeves it's a ditto with a ditto that transformed into a Pikachu <laughs> And it comes with, I think it's, yeah, 64. So that's more than enough for a deck. Put this on the side. And our second bag. <laughs> it's a huge Squirtle. I'm not a big fan of Squirtle, but she bought me this, so thank you. And... We'll leave it on top here. And here's another one. This one's for my girlfriend. She's a big fan of Jigglypuff. Like we've collected all the Jigglypuff that we can find in English version, starting from like the first base set until now. I think the latest one is like Fates Collide or something, but we're almost there. We're missing three cards to complete the whole Jigglypuff collections. And we'll put it besides the gloom. 
And here comes my second pack of deck sleeves. It's a Mimikyu hiding behind a trash bin. This is so depressing. I hope it would somehow drag my opponent down so he or she will have no mood to uh, compete with me anymore. We're just gonna cover you with. We're just gonna cover the Beware promo card with the deck sleeves. And here's our last items from the Pokemon Center in Japan. It's. Yes! It's a Luigi, yeah, Mario crossover Pikachu, and it's a Luigi Pikachu. I was hoping that I could get both of the boxes, but uh, I think the Mario version is out of stock. A lot of the stuff that I want was out of stock. And I've never cracked open a Pokemon TCG products in Japanese. This is actually really exciting. I have to figure a way not to uh, damage the box while I open it. And here's... This can even be my deck box from now on. I can just bring this to the league every week. Okay, so... Inside the box, there's a Luigi Pikachu promo card. That I'm just gonna keep it inside the plastic bag. I'll put it on top of the back sleeves. And I'm getting my ooh, third pack of back sleeves. I believe this one has like 65 or something. But yeah, it's a Luigi Pikachu. So it's way taller than. The Mario one. Mm, wow, I'm suddenly getting three different packs of deck sleeves. So many extra deck sleeves now. And I think this is the uh, divider for this deck box. <coughs> Sorry, my the screen is so small that I can't fit all the products in there in the deck boxes. So big. So I guess I'll leave it out of the camera. And lastly, we have a deck box. Let's open it. Let's open it. I feel like there's something inside the deck box. And, ooh, okay. So it's just two dividers for the uh, deck box. That's so nice, it's so hard, like, it's so hard to damage it, unless my dog managed to pull it down and chew on it. And it sticks, so it's not like other dark box that purely based on a, the plastic. There's actually a sticker that you can stick with it, and dividers, they're so cute. And that's all for this video. These are all the products that I asked my friend to get me from Japan. Thanks again for taking the effort to uh, go all the way to the Pokemon Center. She even went to uh, two different Pokemon Centers for me. One in Kyoto and one in Tokyo. Plushies are so cute. I'm just gonna hang them on my backpack. These are gonna be the... This is gonna be the back for my dice and I'm just gonna carry this back with me like putting everything in there to the tournament from now on and I also get a huge box for storage which is perfect so thanks again for watching sorry that there is no like packs opening in this video it's just a pure like, introductions for of the uh, products from Japan and leave a like if you like the products from Japan and of course you, uh, you can always press the dislike button because of my voice I know I hate my voice as well so 
and also leave any comments that you like let me know what you think about the products from japan and thanks again for watching and i'll see you guys next time with more pokemon tcg products all oh, right remember to subscribe my channel if you want